If you've ever worked with a backdrop before, you know how hard it is to get the wrinkles out of that thing. You gotta bring steamers, run it through the dryer, stretch it, clip it, clamp it, bop it, pull it. And I'm gonna show you a quick little workaround in Photoshop how to get the wrinkles out. Cause I messed up, found a way around it. Gotta tell you about it. So we're gonna go from this to this. And it's super easy. Right click, duplicate layer. Now we are gonna come over to the lasso tool. Click on that. And then we're gonna draw a rough mask around your subject. After you get your subject outlined, right click and push fill. And make sure content aware is selected. Push okay. And boom, deselect. Go to filter, blur. Gaussian blur, crank that thing up, like 110, 120, push OK. Then we're gonna go over here to the right to fill. Um, let's crank that down to about 50%, just so you can see your subject in the background. Then we're going to make sure the background uh, or that copy is selected and go down here to your mask button, click that. Then we're gonna go to the left and grab the brush tool. Make sure we got a big old brush and change the color black. So just color in your subject with the black brush. It doesn't have to be perfect. And then we go back to the right, go to fill, turn that back to 100 and then you can kind of see a little bit better on what you're doing. We just got the subject out the way. Um, color in the spots you, you missed or you think need hit better and if you get a little close you might see that we still have some wrinkles close but if you go down and change your brush to white and then get the background with that you can clear those right up now just go around fix up whatever you need to fix up and voila there you have it wrinkles to no wrinkles it's like botox for pictures follow me for two tutorials a year i've already done two this year this is my second one, so 2023, I got two more for you. Nah, I'm just playing. I might, I might drop a few more. Depends how you guys react. Let me know.